Hi everybody, it's time to start fall plowing. I don't have a lot of time today, but it was a beautiful day, so I decided to get out and at least get my field started. I have Lady with the blacks today, but I actually want to use Bill more than Lady. I have been having troubles with him plowing, so I wanted to spend a little bit more time with him plowing, and we'll see if he can improve any. I'm not sure what happened here, but my furrows are a little bit crooked. I'm going to have to fix them. Tomorrow I'll put Bill in the plow and see how well he does. I'll log with Lady and Bill first thing in the morning and then we'll plow in the afternoon. So here we are in the plowed ground. Jim and the horses have gotten a fair amount done, but Jim has some sort of a breakdown. He just called and asked me if I could bring the four-wheeler out, so I did. I'm hanging with the horses and he's gone to fix something. He said they're not working that great together. Bill does not get along very well with the other guys. He's not being a team player. Right now they're all being good though. There he's coming. What's the problem? I lost a bolt out of the clevis, so I had to go down and get a, another bolt and put it back in the clevis and put the whipple tree back in place. I'm glad the horses behaved when all this took place. Okay, I'm back to plowing again, um, but having some troubles with the scouring on this plow. This is my white horse plow, and it is just not scouring good. For those that might not know what scouring is, it just means it uh, it's coming off the, the mole board, the plow itself, the dirt doesn't stick to it, it comes right off. But I'm having a lot of troubles with that. This one here looks a little better. I took, put some penetrating fluid on the mole boards and I don't expect that they'll stay on for very long at all. But I don't know if it's because it's actually too dry. Um, we've got quite a bit of rain since I plowed last, but I am gaining on the corn ground and then I'll go into the plowed ground. I have Bill today, he's in the furrow right now, and then um, the black horse is on the other side. But we'll see what happens. Okay, of course this is the first furrow for today and it's been a couple days since I plowed but as you can see I've plowed quite a lot. There's over two acres here and this is what's happening. The dirt, I can squeeze into a ball. It's not like it's bone dry. Why, world, is that not scouring? Over here, that one's clean. So, I'll clean that off. 
try another pass and see what happens. Because of all the troubles I've been having, I have a scraper right here with me. The other day when I plowed the bulk of that field, every pass, almost every pass, I'd scrape it down. I apologize for the wind noises and the camera noises. I'll try to just do the rest in talking over it and explain what else is going on. So I decided to call up White Horse Machine and have a ask them if they had some ideas as what's going on. So I did and I had a good long conversation with them. They're a really good company. I've had really good luck with them. They're very helpful in, in any always. So it's not just me that's been having troubles with this not these plows not scouring. This is a number five keystone plow. They also have a number four keystone plow. And these are off-brand plows of the Cavernanan plows. I think that's how you say it. And uh, it is a very slow sloping plow. So in other words, the soil, as it hits the plow, it turns it over very slowly. And so there's very little pressure on the moldboard. And so that's why the plow is not scouring properly because it's just no pressure there on the moldboard. Even here, you can see that next time through, it's a lot better, but there's still some some dirt there that I have to scrape off. It's also interesting that one side does seem to do more than the other side, but uh, um, it's mostly in the soft ground like the corn ground. I'm sure when I hit the sod ground it'll be fine, but uh, they told me there that there's really not much we can do about it. Um, they have tried, and it seems to work, by putting um, wax like you'd wax your car with on the moldboard. It actually stays on quite well and helps out some, so I'm going to try that next year. But uh, in the sod ground, I'm sure it will be fine. They also told me this is something that's happened only happens every few years. It has to do with the weather. Since we had a dry summer, he said he's pretty sure that has a lot to do with it, the fact that it just got dry and then gets the rain now, but it just will not scour as good as it would have normally. Also, soil that has a lot of organic matter in it is actually worse, so um, that may be part of it also. So if you've been plowing this fall and having some scouring problems, you're not alone. I plan on doing another video on me continuing the plowing job into the sod ground and so hopefully there you'll see it plowing and doing a lot better job. Mm.